Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be playing a little bit more Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines, and if I remember correctly, feeding on a cab driver is a criminal violation. Let's get in the cab right now. How do we... Cannot talk during combat. Things are off to a great start. Alright, um... Let's just... Hold on. Hold on. This gives me a decent opportunity. Happy 4th of July, asshole. Okay, go, 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 get in the car, get in the car. Buddy, come on, man, I need to make a getaway. This is ridiculous. Okay. Well, let's try that again. Hey guys, today I'm going to be playing Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. I'm going to head up to King's Head, where we're going to pursue the people that made the snuff film where the girl got killed. If you remember that, the little monsters that were just like a head with legs. Uh, <coughs> that's what we're going to be doing now that I'm not a complete idiot. I have to stop pressing F to interact. I don't know where I got that bad idea because no game uses F to interact, but let's try this now. Hop in. Yeah, let's go. We're heading up to 609 Kingsway. God, I even remembered the name of the address. I'm pretty pleased with myself for how long I've taken off from this game. All right, guys. Let's check that Uzi of ours. All right. Our ridiculous hand cannon which looks way bigger in the picture than it does in real life. Um, okay, I think we're good. I'm gonna actually equip a melee weapon because that's the only thing I'm pretty good at. And it's also something I can holster. There we go. All right, let's snoop around a little bit. There's a door that we can interact with. I'm not doing anything illegal until I have to. So we can't get in this way. So we're definitely going in the back. And these are lights, not cameras, so we should be safe for the time being. Zoop. All right. I am 100% seen. Oh, well, I guess I am in really bright light, but I guess sneaking is pointless. I've already drained the pool for the winter, I suppose. Um, hmm. All right, well, where do we go from here? It is a question I asked myself after graduating college. Um, oh, here we go. Yeah, send the side of the house. All right, that makes sense. And those windows are drawn on. You guys live pretty high on the hog for uh, a snuff film producer. This looks just like the video or the house from the video, so we should probably be ready for war. This is exactly the house from the video. Oh god, that actually startled me. Come here. Jeez. Okay, I'm just gonna go right out on a limb and say this bed is made out of meat. It's made out of people ham. This is not okay. This whole house is disgusting. What's up? Come here. Come on, buddy. You want a piece of my ridiculous combat skills? Come on. Ow, shoot. That did hurt. Okay. I like how they just explode, like, violently. I can still hear some running around, so I'm gonna take it a little easy here, but... It's much better to explore with my... Okay, there's the stairs she ran up. God, this place is gross. All right, um, there's a guest bedroom. Do they have a lot of guests? Um, uh, I mean, master bedroom, two guest bedrooms. Do they have a lot of people that just you know come to visit for the weekend? Come see the house made of people ham. I'm not quite sure. Yeah, come on, come on. What do you think? Just ahead. Think you can take me? Okay, I should stop clicking so furiously. You can probably hear that all over the recording. <laughs> oh, 
this place is gross. All right. Um, to be fair, the kitchen is rather modern. Although spontaneously exploding pieces of what? What are you? Is that a... That's a face, isn't it? That's... Uh, okay. Okay. Well, they have a bunch of blood. So I'm going to assume that our target is either like weirdly like additional about blood like just he he's like oh i didn't have enough blood in the house so i needed extra or we're fighting a vampire which makes quite a bit of sense in fact there is a whole clan of vampires relatively um their special power has to do with crafting flesh so i think i know where we're going and I believe we talked about that with one of our NPCs before. This is a Mishi, so we'll see. Jeez, you guys keep startling me. You know, I went through the entire ghost house without so much as a flicker, and now I'm getting startled constantly. What were you doing in the bathroom? All right, we're going to wait just a minute. We're going to heal ourselves. But I forgot that does not heal aggravated damage. So I guess we're not going to heal ourselves. We're going to waste some blood and then we're going to hit the basement. This looks like the opening scene to Doom. Jeez. Ah, hello, young cave knight. I see your face is not so lifeless. Your nerves not so deadened that you cannot express shock. Tell me, child. Is my appearance that frightening? Or is it my knowledge of you that is so unnerving? Honestly, you look like a stegosaurus. What the hell is going on here? Child of game. The sights in this haven pale in comparison to my ancestral estate. Comfort is a custom. And all of this artifice brings me closer to my home. Do not fear for my furniture, young one. So you're the one that's making snuff tapes, aren't you? Oh, yes. The tape. Merely a test. Certainly not intended to fall into mortal hands. Fortunately, we are in the capital of mortal trickery and illusion. So did the tape drive you to find me? From whence flows your longing, child? I don't know really what's going on down here. <laughs> to gouge out the eyes of the Camarilla. The sewers are clogged with my creations. I will kill or drive the Nosferatu from their pestilent nests. Without the sewer rats to guide them, the Camarilla will be blind to the Sabbat's designs. You know, it's super nice of you to explain all of that to me, because now I can pick a side. I'm sorry, I can't let that happen. Now, Camarilla Web, let me see you fight your nature in the face of those who have embraced their beast. Deny yourself Cain's gifts and be torn asunder by my minions. Okay. That was a neat trick. So is getting punched in the face. Yeah, where are you going? Where are you going? Hey, you know what was nice? Is while he was talking to me, we basically healed all of that damage. Oh, okay. You know, I'm really not going to worry about those guys, and I'm going to get out my... There's a Mishi shooting gun. Strangely enough, it's also my cop shooting gun. Okay, guys, guys, I'm really sorry. I am, I'm really sorry. This is, the minions are harder than he is. He's just moving around, hanging out. All right, so let's make a new strategy, shall we? And that new strategy, is kill his minions fast as he summons them. And then when he shows up, which he will, 
switch to a gun. Well, okay, it's gonna be kind of ridiculous to switch back and forth like that, but let's give it another go. Da, 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 da. Oh, don't tell me. Did I forget to save? Nope, things seem to be okay. All right, good. That could have been awkward. Um, let's see, what do we want to do here? We want to peg him from far away, but we also need to fight the enemies. So like, can we do this? Can we switch between? See, the problem is I have so many guns. This is just ridiculous. All right, we're gonna try this. Let's see, what's the line from Scott Pilgrim? Your club sucks. I've got beef. Let's fight. Oh, Lord. Come on. All right, you magical triceratops. Let's fight. You're a weird guy. It's a madhouse. So they say. Alright, sword time. Go, 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 go. Alright, we're just gonna get into a knockdown drag out brawl, it seems. Oh, I forgot. I totally have celerity. I should be using that. Hold on here, where's my celerity? Get faster. Get stronger. Especially since I can't heal any damage in this entire arena. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Wait. Okay, so I can't get up there? That's dismal. Alright, well. I was hoping that I could get up there and just cheese this boss fight like I've cheesed so many others. Maybe I can get on this thing. There we go. Problem is, Captain Douche is over there, but that's fine. He won't stay over there. Oh, you're right here. What's up? Ah, the joys of playing a non-combat Torador. To be fair, he is being very convenient with where he's showing up. Maybe my shotgun will do more damage? I don't know. Makes me happier regardless. <clears throat> Whatever, yeah, you can go over there. I don't even care. Hey guys, I hope you didn't tune in for entering uh, interesting like combat or any kind of gameplay of any sort because you're definitely not going to see it on this channel. I wish you would come back over here though. <clears throat> I miss my crossbow. I should go buy more ammo for it. I could probably hit him over there with that. I also like, look at how far off the aimer got. Like, it's all crooked. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep shooting at you. It doesn't really matter. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. What's up? You want some more? I got some more. Oh, hey, what's up? Didn't see you over there. I'll take the least efficient way to kill a vampire for 100, Bob. I confronted him, but he did not die. All right, let's equip our katana. Weeaboo sword, go. Let's fight these guys. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. If I die against his minions, I'm going to be so mad. Alright, cool. Um, 
Everything went better than expected. It's back here. Great. Just great. Um, yeah, I'm going to make a safety save. I'm pretty sure I already got one, but I'm going to make another one just to make sure because I do not want to do that again. Rats, where are you guys going? Oh, this is his route into the sewers from where he has been terrorizing the Nosferatu. I'm going to keep my sword put away. Well, I see you over there. Yeah, what's up, dude? Clifford, I will read you in just a minute. Because I have a feeling that guy can get to me somehow. Maybe I gave him too much credit. All right, let's check out this clipboard. Looks like a clipboard of an employee of Los Angeles Department of Water and Power. They have all the water and all the power. All right. Strange sightings in the sewers. Quadrant 13 seems normal. Heard unidentified noises at points in both quadrants 14 and 15. Called into dispatch to confirm that no other inspectors were working in that area. There were none. Coordinates noted. Investigation into 16 tomorrow. Some sort of animal. Again, investigation in the older part of the sewers this morning. Saw again what I believe to be an animal, though I don't know how to classify it. Sim seems to be bare, almost reptilian, and I can hear it constantly, almost as if it is following me. Oh god, help me, saw creature, some sort of monstrosity, teeth and blood, can't get out, no more light, can't reach anyone, oh god, what is that? He was dedicated to his journal. Alright, poor guy. That doesn't really help us other than we know already that there are monsters in the sewers. So, surprise guys, there are monsters in the sewers. Where does this lead? Hold on, where? All right, let's go this way then. Oh, game, there we go. I've missed you, Vampire the Masquerade bloodlines. I've missed getting stuck on ladders and being confused and lost. All right, all right, all right, here we go. Oh, I see you. Come on, buddy. Nice. All right, that went well. Hey, I could eat that rat for a blood point. It's ridiculous and kind of disgusting, but you could totally do it. That's going to be an interesting jump. No, oh, never mind. I take that back. It worked just fine. I don't like these solid black tunnels. I also like that as a vampire, I do not have a flashlight. You'd think that, you know, with loitering around in the dark everywhere, I would want one. Okay, so this is back where I came in. Where is this? That is not... That doesn't look right. But no, I actually, you're right. This is where I crawled in. So I've gone in a big circle. Um, that's wonderful. Let's see where this goes. <laughs> Cheesing boss fights and wandering around in circles. Pretty much how this channel operates. That is just a big thing to nowhere. So it means this has got to go somewhere. Um... I really don't remember any of this part of the game. Like, I've played the, like, downtown part of this game, like, three or four times, but I've only gotten this far once before. So, we're learning and exploring together. Pretty sure this is right. We do have to get on the other side of that wall, but I think I took the wrong turn there. Alright, so that's where I was. Let's not go that way. Let's go this way. That doesn't look promising. That does look promising. 
but can we trust this particular pipe to go there? Probably not. Oh, no, look, we got lucky. Okay. <sighs> Gird yourself for some more combat here. <sighs> I think I figured those guys out. The, um... The most important part... Oh, gosh, I do not want to swim in third person. Can we just not swim in third person? Okay, so we can't. All right, well, let's open this thing then that I didn't see before. Um, they, they, whenever you swing a melee weapon at them, they have this auto-canned like dodge hit that they can do. And when you uh, like use that to back them into a corner and then you can beat on them. I'm gonna get kicked in the ass while I'm lockpicking. Oh, no, all right. Let's check out this supply room first. A ledger. Something with a piece clipped out of it? Haunted sewers bricked over. Bodies never found. Bizarre. Double bizarre. All right, so let's go back over here and see what we can come up with on this side. Oh, glory be to the ammo gods. A bunch of magnum rounds, a bunch of shotgun ammo that I cannot take bunch of bullet clips bullet clips I mean I suppose uh, it's not technically a clip it's a magazine and we could go into that whole uh, that whole spiel but I'm going to just avoid it come here oh Yeah, what up? Come here. Nice. Okay, those are all places I can go. I'm gonna go check out that bricked over part first. I just wanted to make sure I had hunted all the enemies here because I hate being surprised. Not my favorite thing. All right, let's go check over this little place over here. See where this leads us. Does this leave us out? to so we could hit the city go get blood or something that might be a decent thing to do or nah i where okay so that is the old sewers and this is the new sewers i see and that is a permanently locked door so let's go back this way. What? I was like, the cardboard box is in front of the door. I can't open it. <laughs> All right. So here we go. So where are we? I, this does not have a where you are here on it. That's really inconvenient. There, we are in one of those rooms. I guess we have to head around there. Um take shower on Sunday all right um yeah so there's what we dealt with and that's how we looped back on ourselves so here I think what we need to do is find this straight one and go straight through there because I don't think we can get around either way but we might have to be a little bit tricky so we'll see all right so we're looking for the one that's straight yeah I mean it looks like a straight shot I guess it is get there eventually could make a joke about the light at the end of the tunnel but mostly I just hate myself because what is going on because we can't get through this darn it and the water is really acting up I'm gonna look away from that there okay um so from here we can see that that side is kind of open so let's go see if we can get around the gate 
on that side. I'm so sorry to submit you to this again, but we gained some useful information, even if we did have to crawl for two hours. So if you guys have been watching any of AGDQ, or no, SGDQ, it's summer, um, that marathon charity stream i've actually quite a big fan of it i haven't watched that much this year as much as i did last year but i am still a fan and i still enjoy it and if you're looking for something to do and you've already watched my videos we're not going that way it doesn't seem to work um give them a shot actually watch them first they're doing a good thing for charity and i'm just messing around I guess third time's a charm. This one's capped off, so where am I supposed to go? In there? That seems pointless. All right, I see you. Come here. Come here. Ah! Gotta let me go. That animation, I just get stuck in it. There we go. Jeez. You know, I should have just walked this way to start with, rather than crawling down that tunnel. I feel like an idiot. This is like mutant head baseball. Four strikes and you're out. Well, this was super useful, guys. All right. So, we've got to figure out... Oh, we have to take the center exchange and go around to the other side on the far side of the gate. That makes sense. All right. So, to do that, I'm pretty sure we have to crawl through this one. Actually, I, yeah, because this it has sort of a bend in the middle of it. Ooh, a really old piece of sewer. There. I think I've played entire Xbox 360 games that use only this texture. I mean, there's probably other games like that too, but that just reminds me of like the early Xbox 360 era texture pack. Of, like the wet concrete that every game used. I, I distinctly remember all of Perfect Dark Zero being, like, soaking wet all the time. I don't know. It's just everything was shiny. They're like, we've got this new shader. Let's use it, guys. And so they did. Nice. All right, so we've made it to the lake of graphical glitches. Ugh. Let's drain that terrible beast. Thank goodness. Wait, that was bad. I, we're not dead, are we? I didn't really have a chance to not go this way, but okay, cool. At least I know I won't drown. Hey guys, what's going on here? There's like a, this is like that place where they put, uh, they banish the vampires to die in interview with a vampire. There's like a weird underground basin. Okay, that is entirely game designy. Like they do not just have like random giant spinning What is that? That is ridiculous. Okay, guys, calm down. Plenty of sword for all of you. Actually, there you know there may not be sword for all of you. Where do those other guys go? Oh, they're down there in the water? Well, that's depressing. Um, can I shoot them from in here? I'm gonna, I bet you I can, hold on. Let's get my favorite gun. Yeah, there we go, we're just gonna do this. I just don't want them coming back to haunt me later. Because it looks really weird when they explode underwater, that's kind of gross. All right, um, that one leads to a different room. 
in some kind of water treatment plant here. This leads to an identical room. Oh man, Zelda Lost Forest all over again. You suck, you know that? You suck. You suck, you suck, you suck. Does crawling in here have any purpose? No, it doesn't. I'm not gonna do it anymore. Um... You know, I wish I had a map of this segment of the water. Okay. Do I, should I swim back that way because this is a different room? Or should I go back this way? I'm not 100% certain. Those are both just empty. All right. Let's see if we could take this way. Maybe the blades are broken or something we can get through here. Oh god, I forgot you were in there. I forgot you were in there. Oh golly. Have you ever seen the trailer park boys? They just shoot their gun at nothing. That's what this reminds me of. Just shooting my gun at the water. I really don't like where this is going. I can't get out on that side either. Come on. All right, I'm going to make a safety save, and then we're going to do some dumb stuff. Dumb thing number one. Let's see if we can swim through those blades. I am thinking distinctly not, but especially since there's nothing but a black inky void on the other side, but we got to... Okay, yeah, one touch and we're done. Also, my computer does not like water effects plus final effect or final death. All right, so that was fun. Um, what's the other thing we can do? Um, I mean, we do have to get up there. I see that, but I don't think I can jump on those blades. In either case, can I shut them off? No. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm just gonna have to resort. Oh God, the place is a mess. The DNA evidence in here is ridiculous. Um, I'm gonna have to resort to crawling around in the dark. I'm sorry. I tried to avoid it, at least a bit. So these two are both just cross pipes. Let's go this way. This one has a little more detail. Oh man, I fell in the water. Put your gun away. Yep, this is just a hidey hole for monsters. There's really not anything else. Oh, what? Oh, hold on. I have an idea. Put your gun away. Beautiful. So now... Yeah, buddy. That's how you do it. Okay, and I need to not have a gun. I need to have um, my katana out to fight these guys. All right, come here. Did he just do like a, like a Samus roll? These guys are ridiculous. Nice backswing on that one. You know, I'd probably have a much better time killing these guys if I actually had combat skills. But you know what? It's not what this game is about. Despite the random forced combat levels. Okay, we're getting pretty hurt again. Might have to start taking it easy for a bit here. Oh, man. There's a glitch hole. I will bet you there's more of those monsters down there. And I'm not quite ready to fight them yet. Uh, I'm going to be a pansy, and I am going to safety safe again. Because I would hate to have to crawl through all these pipes and wander around in this nonsense. 
Yeah, what did I say? Let's go. Let's just go. We're just gonna go. We're just gonna go. I'm not gonna deal with them. They can follow me down here and kill me. And they probably will. Okay. Where in the world? Oh, we're in one of the big processing tanks. Okay. Doo 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 doo. All right, Half-Life. Um, great. And I'm in the water. And am I taking damage? I really don't know. Which it, I mean, it should, like, yeah, it should shock the entire area, not just, yeah, all right, whatever. Let's just stand on this metal pipe because metal does not conduct electricity figure this out um there doesn't seem to be a way to get up there oh there is there's a ladder right there you guys are just too proud of yourselves aren't you um you know what we're gonna do inventory look at those blood packs i picked up that i somehow lost because of my loading of that save let's not worry about that then. Alright, um... Blood heal doesn't really do that much to heal aggravated damage. Although, it seemed to do just fine there. Does it accelerate your... It doesn't seem to. Alright, well, in that case... Okay, let's see. Um, let's just go for it. Yep, one little shot isn't as bad as a couple of hits from those guys, so. Yeah, I could have seen that coming. Alright, you know what we're gonna do, guys? Let's load the game. Um, let's take a quick save here, and let's call this episode for now. We've been playing for quite a while, so we'll continue scumming it in the sewers here uh, next time. Take it easy.